As a YouTuber, I have to ask myself, what do I enjoy more? What kind of videos do I want to make? What type of games do I want to play? And I'm going to be honest right now. Black Ops 4 and Battlefield 5 are not my favorite shooters, and in fact, I'm having less and less fun the more I play them. Battlefield 5 stripped away all of my situational awareness, made me more codependent, and removed the sandbox that was Battlefield 4. But boom, it's a World War II game! I know it is, and that's the problem. The inherent design of it does not excuse it from being the problem. It's my same problem with Battlefield 1. Just because it's World War 1 doesn't mean I'm supposed to go, oh, that's right, it's World War 1, I like it now. No, sorry, look, whether it's small little meta design choices that impact the game in small and interesting ways, or it's just the time period that the game takes place in and the limits that come with that, I don't care. I don't like it. I don't like it. So I'm not playing it, and I don't have many nice things to say about it. And I feel like I've been kind of faking a smile with Black Ops 4 and Battlefield 5, but mostly with Black Ops 4, but recently my Black Ops 4 videos have gotten in more... negative. The complaints I had in the beta are still alive and present into the launch. I'm annoyed. I'm annoyed and it's repetitive. The map design is not interesting, and it's very, very annoying to play. I don't hate either of these games. When I play them, I constantly say I hate these games, I hate these games, I hate these games, but I genuinely don't. I don't think they're awful video games, but they're not for me. Look, tell me I need to get good all you want, but it's just not my style, and when it's not my style, I don't get good at it. That's, that's my rule of FPS games. If it doesn't grab me, I don't attempt to get better at it. Case in point, I am not an amazing Rainbow Six Siege player, but I really, I really like playing it. I like getting better at it. I feel successful when I do well, and although sometimes I feel bullshitted and I'll have an entire night where I do terrible, I keep playing. Black Ops 4 and Battlefield 5 feel very strict. Like they want me to do one to three things per match, and it feels very, very restricting. And that gets old after a while. And with Rainbow Six Siege, the amount of ways you get to play the game is just so fun. Playing around with the different operators and different weapon attachments and different strategies with your friends is just so rewarding, even when it's annoying. It's challenging, I'm not great at it, but I'm having fun. I don't need to be good at a game to have fun in it. I'm not an amazing gamer, but I know when a game isn't my style. So if you want to tell me I, I'm only saying this because I'm bad at Battlefield 5, Hell no. I was terrible at Battlefield 4 and 3 and Hardline, and I still enjoyed them until I got better at them. Because if I enjoy a game, I will sit and grind it, and as I'm grinding it, I'm gaining confidence, I'm learning about it, I start to watch videos about it, and with Battlefield 5 and Black Ops 4, that's just not the case. Like I've said, Battlefield 5 stripped away all of my situational awareness and made me more codependent. And when I play Black Ops 4, I'm just constantly waiting for the other shoe to drop. I think it's so cute that people tell me I don't like Black Ops 4 because I'm bad at it because, really, I have fought players that are a hundred times better than me, they kick my ass here and there, I win a couple gunfights, and then I pull out a specialist ability or weapon and I end their lives, and it's really funny, like if you watch my Hunting for Christmas Noobs video, the guy that keeps consistently beating me throughout that match, I cut out some of the deaths because, I don't know, they weren't entertaining and I was bad, either way. He was better than me, and I just like pull out the Tempest and I'm like, oh, see you, bitch, and what was he supposed to do? You can, you can go watch that video, you can see the spot where I just hammer everybody with my Tempest and get full streaks from it. It makes the game feel random, it makes the game feel messy, and it's not the reason I got into Call of Duty. And on top of that, the map design is so repetitive and boring and the pacing is all the same. It's the same problem I've had since Advanced Warfare, the pacing is always the same. The best thing old CODs did was have a wide variety of maps, and within each map, there's a wide amount of variety, so your engagements didn't feel repetitive. So throughout a long grind of Modern Warfare 2, you could play Estate, and then Rust, and then Derail, and then you could play Terminal, and they all play different, and they have a different pace to them, and they promote different strategies, whether it's campy or rushy, whether it's reactionary or bullshit, and it's kind of fun. Black Ops 4 doesn't give me that. Black Ops 4 honestly is the most repetitive, aggravating romp I've had in a while, and I'll just play it occasionally if my friends want to. And Battlefield 5 doesn't give me that fun sandbox feeling that Battlefield 3 and 4 did. And I'm sorry if that sounds like casual garbage to you, but that's why I got into Battlefield. It's because I play a wide variety of shooters, and when I go into Battlefield, it's freeing. It's not repetitive, it's not aggravating, it's not a clusterfuck, it's more freeing, I have more options. And Battlefield 5 is a lot more restricting because of its time period and just the inherent design of the maps is also just not that interesting. 
and so it doesn't give me what I want from Battlefield, it's as simple as that. So on this channel, you guys are going to probably see more old Call of Duty gameplay, some Battlefield 4, and a lot of Rainbow Six. And I'm going to end this video with an analogy for all of you that think that I'm wrong in everything that I'm saying. If you guys were a fan of Hershey's milk chocolate bars, and then one day Hershey's said, I'm not going to sell milk chocolate bars anymore, I'm only going to sell dark chocolate. If I told you to just suck it up and adapt your taste buds to dark chocolate, you'd probably be mad, right? No, you'd probably go buy a milk chocolate bar from a different brand, right? And that's exactly what I'm doing. My favorite franchises have adopted new flavors, new styles that I'm not a fan of. So I'm gonna go get my milk chocolate somewhere else. I don't hate Battlefield 5. I don't hate Black Ops 4. I don't think they're garbage. I don't think the fans of them are garbage, but I don't wanna sit and grind them. I don't care to get better at them. And I hope you guys can respect that. There will still be Black Ops 4 videos and Battlefield 5 videos occasionally, but just not as much, not as frequently, because I'm just basically only going to play it if a couple friends want to play it with me. And that's it, because I have no incentive to sit and grind them and get better at them when I'm just not a fan of the styles they provide. Anyway, hope you guys didn't hate this video, and if you feel like unsubscribing after this, that's okay, I'm sorry. I'm not becoming an R6S channel or anything like that, I'm just... I'm just, uh, I have to follow what I want to do, otherwise I'll make myself miserable. Anyway, see when I see you. Goodbye. God damn it, they came in. Oh, man, they were crew rushing. This is... Nice. Nice. Good win. Good win. Good win.